Ladies and gentlemen, you wanted to see the car that won the showdown, and that wasn't it. But unfortunately, it could have been. But Ryan Partridge just didn't want to run it. So Ryan, you took out the Batmobile. How did that fare for you? Oh, well, like you said, I was really planning on driving this thing, but something about it did not fit in template. They didn't like it. I don't know. I think I think so, it's because of the gas mileage, personally. Oh, that, yeah, that, that had to have been it. Um, no, it was fun. I'm, I'm absolutely ecstatic right now. I've just, we just won the Toyota All-Star Showdown, man. I, this is the biggest race I've ever run, um, let alone win. So I just, I pray something comes of this and we can start progressing. Yeah, it must be nice to win a race as big as this on national television. Yeah, it's funny how that worked out, huh? Um, Just a little funny. Yeah, yeah. Well, what do you, you you said it all. That's that's excellent. I mean, we couldn't have planned any better. It's what we were shooting for. Uh, to be honest, I there's a lot of tough competition here. I I don't like getting my hopes up thinking oh well, we're, we have it or nothing like that um, we just it was a race of attrition we saved our tires and we played the game a little bit better than everybody else there were a lot of very very good competitors out there and I was scared a couple times but I, I still I it still hasn't sunk in we'll wait, we'll wait for tomorrow now talking about your competitors out there Joe Anitis was running out in front of you smoke started coming from under that car what was going through your mind at that point I knew he was starting to blow up or something was up um, we were catching him pretty quick uh, we almost wrecked each other <laughs> we almost wrecked each other it was real close um, he blew up right in front of me going into three I actually lifted his his rear end up yeah, I know, I know. Okay. And luckily I was already kind of pointed into the corner, so it kind of slid out, and which saved us both. But it was it was very, very close. Too close. Now we're, just, we're talking about Joe Nidus right now, right? Nidus, yeah. Uh, well, then I'm going to start talking about another guy who looked like he had a similar case with coming out of turn four. They're uh, probably biggest competitor out here for you, Alex Haas. Yes. Uh, me and Alex go way back racing together. We're very comfortable racing with each other. I knew that it was coming time towards the end, and I heard that 66 was behind me. Um, I started to get a little worried. I know he's a very strong competitor. I knew he was going to want to flex his muscles towards the end. Uh, he was going to save his stuff till the end. He's smart. Um, he did exactly that. He tried to play some games with us, getting us to slip up, uh, get me to drive over my head. I think we, we played the cool card and, and came out on top. I knew our car was better than his. We saved our tires a little better than his while he was too wide most of the, most of the race. Um, yeah, that was, that was, that was nuts. The, we, we, beat, we were beating and banging on each other for a couple laps there. And then there was a, finally got in front of him with like five to go. And my biggest worry was just checking out so that he didn't have a chance for that white flag. Because I knew that white flag drop, man, it's anybody's game. And we probably <laughs> both would have wrecked, so. Yeah. And uh, w would you say that the key in that race for your win was that last restart? Well, the second to last restart, that, that, that wouldn't have worked, that's for sure. I spun the tires, I effed up. Um, but luckily, thank God, we had another restart, and I was able to gather it back up and, and do what we needed to do to win the showdown. How about we find out who Ryan Partridge has to thank for winning the Toyota All-Star Showdown Super Late Model Race? Eshelman Racing, Ibox Springs, Brock Rental Incorporated. Uh, we had Extends on board for this, uh, this race. Um, everybody involved, the whole crew, I mean, this is a huge team effort. Uh, I'm just the lucky shoe that gets to get all the TV. Um, the low budget the, TV. The low budget TV, I, I'm stoked. Um, but no, there's a ton of people involved, a lot of dedication, tons of man hours, and I think it, it sh well, obviously paid off and showed, so. Ladies and gentlemen, Ryan Partridge, your winner, and hopefully next time we get the black flip. Yeah. Yeah, I, agree. I know that. I agree. I agree with you. <laughs> I agree with me. <laughs> Ryan Partridge, everybody. Well,